Okay, so I just want to give you a demonstration of the demonst of the case study that I built showing you exactly how this website that you're on right now was put together. Now the structure of the site, the look of the site has changed actually since I did this case study. I enhanced the graphics and I, I put different wet widgets on the sidebar. But what this will show you is how to start with basically an empty WordPress site. So I'm going to assume you can get WordPress up and running and installed and if you can I can help you with that too. And then Basically, from an empty site, how do you populate it? How do you write content for it? How do you do search engine optimization? How do you plan your keywords? Uh, how do you set up um, widgets on the sidebar? Everything top to bottom. And this is something that I think a lot of people need to see because WordPress takes time to learn. You, you really need to learn it in increments. So what I've tried to do is, in a single case study, show you everything that I learned as, a, you know, as I went through learning WordPress over a co the course of probably two years and it's condensed into these 10 videos. So what you get is you start off with an introduction here. I'll turn up my volume so you can hear it a little. And so the video is going to fire up here. Hey, this is Justin Popovich, and uh, I'm just sitting here in my office, and I'm about to record, have a coffee here, <laughs> and I'm about to record a, uh, a, a, an entire... Okay, so you get an idea there. I, I just do the case study intro. Uh, I talk about why, how I plan on using this site. So it's the same thing will apply to you. You sit down, you plan out how you want to build your WordPress site. Uh, so I talk about that, and then the second video, we go into the WordPress dashboard. Again, if you've seen WordPress, not a problem. But if you haven't, or if you're just starting out with WordPress, this gives you a start. So now I've logged in to my new WordPress website as the administrator of this site. And what I'm looking at right now is called the WordPress dashboard. As the so that's about 12 minutes, 13 minutes there, and uh, I walk you through everything you need to know about the dashboard. Then we talk about plugins. Plugins are really important for WordPress. They, um, you'll see. So here. at this point, I've had a chance to familiarize myself with the WordPress dashboard, and I walk through just the general options, things that you you'll get familiar with very quickly. But now I want to dive into some of the stuff that's more hands-on. And and as you start to build a site and develop your blog and and build content. These are the things you really are going to need to be aware of. And we're going to start at one of the most important sections of your WordPress site, and that's called the plugins section. And there's actually a few plugins that I want to install right here and, and now because I don't want to do anything else in my blog until I know that these plugins are running. It's for a very specific reason. So let me open up the plugin section. And the first plugin that I want to talk about here is called. I don't actually know how to pronounce it correctly. I believe it's Akismet. Okay, so get into plugins. And then I get into, I'm not going to show all these videos in the demo here, but then I get into actually planning out the website, how I want to structure it. Uh, I'm using a theme called Headway, so I can actually really customize where the sidebars are, what the overall look and feel of the website is. Even if you're not using Headway, you can follow through on these lessons and get, and get a lot of value. I show you how I actually filmed my About page which is a little different because not people don't usually show the behind the scenes, so I show that. Then I do a pretty big one on keyword research and SEO preparation. This is where I look at monthly statistics from Google on different keywords that I'm planning to go for. Um, I'm number one on Google for success coach for my success coaching website, Ignite Your Essence. So I have a lot of SEO background and experience, so I just give you some of those you know, main things you need to know on a WordPress site for doing that. How to write your first five blog posts. Uh, there's a feature called the Featured Content Gallery, which makes your WordPress site look really nice. You could put images that scroll across, and people can uh, can find your content based on those images. It's really nice. And then I get into adding widget or widgets to the sidebar, and that can have anything. It could have a Twitter widget, or you could have you know it could be marketing things, or affiliate offers, or your own opt-in boxes, whatever. And then uh, how to do stat counting and different analytical software. So I talk about Google Analytics and Stat Counter, and show you how to actually read those metrics. So for anybody that's never seen a WordPress site behind the scenes or wants to build their own, you can literally watch these 10 videos and get pretty much everything you know to get up and running. And if you don't, just let me know and I can give you a hand or I can point you in the right direction to get more information. So I hope you're interested in looking at this and I'll see you on the other side.